addition to the criticism from the governor, two Republican members of Congress from South Florida have spoken out against what the president said. Carlos Corbello and Ileana Ross Leighton had strong words for the president. Here's Congresswoman Ross Leighton. The, the statements of the president are reprehensible, they're racist, they're totally incorrect. Uh, talking about Haiti, saying people from Haiti, that's a whole country. Um, this is a pattern of racist statements. This is a man who made his name in the political world uh, doubting President Obama's uh, American citizenship, saying that he was born in Kenya. Then he launched his campaign saying that Mexicans are rapists and criminals, uh, banning all Muslims uh, temporarily from coming to the United States, uh, slow to condemn uh, racists like David Duke in Charlottesville, Virginia, when there was uh, white racist uh, against other folks, he was saying, well, there's blame on both sides. No, there wasn't. This issue hits home for a lot of people here. According to the Migration Policy Institute, the United States has the largest Haitian population outside Haiti. And in Florida, we have the largest Haitian population within the U.S. An estimated 80,000 are here in Miami-Dade and Broward each. And Palm Beach has another estimated 56,000. Reaction to the president's controversial remarks coming in fast. Wake up with CBS 4 this morning, beginning at 4.30 a.m. for all of the overnight developments.